The compact disc, CD, was developed in the early 1980s by Philips and Sony as a new format for storing and playing digital audio. The first commercial CD player was released in 1982, and the format quickly gained popularity due to its superior sound quality and durability compared to cassette tapes. In the early 1990s, CD players became a standard feature in home stereo systems and car audio systems. They also became popular for portable music listening, with the introduction of portable CD players and CD boomboxes. The popularity of CD players peaked in the late 1990s and early 2000s. However, the introduction of digital music formats such as MP3 and the rise of portable music players such as the iPod led to a decline in CD player sales. Despite the decline in sales, CD players are still used by many people today. They are a popular choice for audiophiles who appreciate the superior sound quality of CDs. CD players are also still used in many car audio systems. Here are some of the key milestones in the history of CD players. 1979, Philips and Sony begin collaborating on the development of a new digital audio format. 1980, the Red Book CDDA standard is published, defining the technical specifications for CDs. 1982, the first commercial CD player, the Sony CDP101, is released in Japan. 1983, CD players are introduced to the United States and Europe. 1985, the first portable CD player, the Sony D50, is released. 1990s, CD players become a standard feature in home stereo systems and car audio systems. Late 1990s slash early 2000s, CD players reach peak popularity. Mid 2000s, sales of CD players begin to decline due to the popularity of digital music formats and portable music players. Today, CD players are still used by many people, particularly audiophiles and those who prefer physical media.